Alright, hello guys, so my name is Idos Games, and today I'm going to be doing a uh, video for how you guys are supposed to make intros. Uh, I know a couple months ago you guys asked me to uh, do a uh, video on how to make the intros, and today I'm going to do that. So, first of all you want to go into a browser and search up clip. Maker 2. Let that to load up. And you have this first link right here. Just click on that. And you come up to this portion right here. What I would suggest using if you were just barely starting off right now, instead of making your like a whole brand new intro yourself, I would suggest going all the way down to the bottom and go into community templates. Okay, and you have a whole ton of templates people have used. But like, it's like, oh man. Okay, so you have a whole bunch of templates right here, which you can use for yourself. Most of them will have music and stuff on them. So, so let's just go with this one right here. Okay, it's an awesome green intro template Rio. So, so you want to click Open in Clip Maker. Now allow you it to edit. Okay, and then you have to wait for that to load up a little bit for a second there. So yeah, um, first I want to talk for a minute. It's like, I'm sorry that I wasn't able to make very many videos because I was very busy. I had school and... With, with having to do school and a job all at the same time, it was kind of hard for me to do both. So, I apologize for not having videos out this summer, and I promise I'll probably try to do more, okay? So, first of all, so you see how it has just this right here? So, you want to maybe click on this. Just click on this eyeball right here. And it brings you to like this. Then you have to press play. <laughs> See, and that's pretty much the intro. It just you can go in here. Um, you have different kind of things you can do, like choose a scene that will do like the background. And I'll choose like the background. I'll change like this right here behind the name. But with this one particular one, we'll keep it that way. And you have like the text and stuff. So let's just put in here. Let's say. YouTube. We'll just put YouTube because why not? Put YouTube right there and then up here again. See how, like, right here it changes out to have the different, like, a different word here. So you can see, like, over here we got faded out E from the YouTube area. So I want to change the other one to YouTube as well. I spelled that wrong. I want to change the other one to YouTube as well. So now, and then it's like that. But you see how it just sort of like hides. I do a little bit of the words. Um, so you might want to change that a little bit. So you can go down here. You can go to height. Change that down a little bit. I'll say 25, and I'll see what that does. And then. Go down the other one, do the same thing, just like that. And then that's the intro. Unless you want to add in other things, so you have effects like fish eye, shutter, bloom, and analyze. That's a lot of thing. I I can't say that, but anyway. Also, with these words, you could change, like, maybe, like, the emissive, co like, the color. So, he's got a, so the person who made this, he's already put a color on here. You don't really want to change that. If you like the color, you like what it looks like, then keep it like that. But, otherwise, if you want to change the color, that was, that is where you would go. It's right there. Also, if you're going to look at appearance, I would, I would say, just go with single color, if you're planning on changing it. Because it makes it easier and doesn't mix up things, because sometimes it can change what you're doing 
Okay, then you also have like the shake and the shake speed and like the rotation stuff inside when you're when it's going to do that in your video. So, right here, so if you down to the bottom, it shows the bottom of the um, chain. So it shows just like here. So position is going to be the red bar here. And that's where it's going to be, and that's where it's going to be changing the position. Uh, rotation, same thing. Changing the rotate, like rotating. Shake, same thing. Same spot, it's going to be shaking around in that area. And the shake speed, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. Don't know about the shake speed. Like that. Um, you have visual resolution. If you want to change the size of it, you can just go right in here. Change that to that. It, it sort of changes it a little bit. It won't change on the screen, but it will change on the download you do. So then we come down here to the download your video. And this is where you can start, start, and this is where you can download your intro and be able to put it on videos that you want to do. So then you would just click here, click start video render, and eventually it will start here and get all the way to the back. Okay, I'll be back in a minute. So I'm actually, um, while well, I'm going to be waiting for this to finish downloading so I can download it for you guys, I'm actually going to show up here, going here, um, so I have, a, I've made, uh, plenty of these myself, um, I have some of just, just me, and then I have some for, like, other people, I made a couple special ones for, like, my parents, for, like, Father's Day and Mother's Day and stuff, um, so I'm just gonna, like, pop these up, let you guys see for a little bit, look at these ones, I've actually gotten a couple others from other people, um, so, these are the two I made for Father's and Mother's Day, so, um, and these ones, it's just five Guardio intros that are all put together in one one, so, look, just watch this, hope you enjoy. Mario! Okay, so that's just one of them. Um, and then you click just to the, off to the side. And then we have one for a ghost. Um, a guard. He's he's one. He's very uh, famous with his like a guard with like a lot of Gario content and stuff on his channel. This is just a, an intro somebody made for him. That's just ghost one. Um, I also made one for just my friend. It was kind of hard to see, but um, actually no. Um, here's one that my friend made, which he allowed me to uh, show. Not really show, but he allowed me to have. Um, here's one. He made this, by the way. This is on. I'm uh, also guys. I'm gonna say if you see any of the, any of these intros that you see people of, I suggest that you go check them out. They're all really cool, guys. So this is so the this one and I think this one were both made by this guy. This is one of my friends. Um, he's he's amazing at this. So you guys should go, all go check him out. Uh, subscribe. That kind of stuff, okay? See, because intros are a very basic thing that people make. So, I have a video of, of this one online right now on youtube so you guys can go check that one out uh here's one op gaming like i said all you guys should go check out their channels and uh subscribe i'm suggesting you guys also go subscribe to So 
So uh, yeah, that was uh, OP Gaming's uh, intro. So here, we, here I'm just gonna go over to mine now. So I decided, why not? I'm gonna keep a couple of my old intros. So I think this was one of my first intros I ever made. One of my very first intros I've ever made. I, I think. Yeah, I'm, I think this is one of my very first intros. <laughs> Yeah, that's when I had a. Uh, my name was Panther King. If you guys didn't know, my very first YouTube name I had was a uh, GBR Panther King. But the thing is, I had a problem with that because of that Panther King was for some reason was in a game, and I would have had copyright issues if I decided to use that as my name. So I had I had some issues with that, and I think this is one of my latest intros. I think I deleted most of my old ones because I kept taking up too much space so here's this one and then hopefully the uh, thing will be done by this one time when this is over oh man play there we go what? why do you keep closing? Okay, that was a major lag spike right there. Um, you guys probably didn't feel it, but I did. It's in there for maybe like 30 seconds, just went, what the crap happened? Yeah, it was pretty much the same thing that was uh, that was um, OP Gaming's intro, but I put my name into it. Um, so hopefully this is done now. Almost there. Okay, so I'll see you guys. Alright guys, I'm back now. So as you guys probably realize right here, it, the bar had gotten to the very end. And after that is done, this pops up. And if you want to uh, download your video, just click here. And it'll pop up a new thing saying, Thank you for using Palanzoid, your download starting. Then this will pop up right here. And this will be saved into your downloads. Or you can just open it up like that. You can see your intro. See, now we have successfully uh, gotten an intro to use. So, like I said, you guys, you can use that. Put your own name on it but remember guys try to uh, you have to ask if you're gonna make intros you have to ask people if you can use theirs as like stuff so if you're gonna use theirs then you have to uh, talk to the person who owns it see if you can uh, use it but on the public ones like the public ones here you're able to use those like freely okay you're able to use those whenever you want so the public ones are there for everyone um, also, so for the, if you're gonna like download like stuff from like YouTube and stuff, I don't, I don't, I'm not suggesting this, I'm just saying if you are, then please do not go and down and put it on your channel because if you're taking someone else's content, content that is copyright and, and you can get humongously fined for it, so try not to take other people's intro and use, use it as like your own content, please. Okay, so that's all that we, I have for you today, so... Thank you guys. Hope you had fun. I'll see you guys later.